Hey everybody, we're gonna be making some Yao Han, some Cambodian hot pot. So this is heating, got some oil in there, and make sure it's hot, and you're gonna add some minced garlic to it. Yes, you wanna make sure that it's sizzling, okay? Because, you know, it just make it taste better, you want it to cook fast, and you're gonna stir that up. And then you wanna make sure that it's not brown you want to make sure it's golden okay and then when it's golden you want to add your next ingredients because you don't want this to burn all right so next we're going to add some coconut this coconut milk or should i say coconut cream is used in a lot of thai lao cambodian cooking and also all around southeast asia now we're going to add some soybean sukiyaki uh, mix and this base is really delicious there's a non-spicy one there's a spicy one we chose the spicy because spice is life okay all right and make sure you get that whole bottle in there shake it all out because you know it's very thick so you're gonna shake 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 and then you're gonna stir 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 all right all right the next thing we're gonna add is some minced crab and spices this is gonna give you a lot of umami flavor from the crab and it's also going to give you some heat okay because you know spice is life that's right add the whole thing and don't forget to mix it because it's a little thick too we like it a little thick the next thing we're gonna add is some chicken broth from the can not the powder because this is very delicious it has such a rich flavor the next thing we're gonna add is a barbecue sauce. It's an Asian barbecue sauce. It's gonna make your dish just taste very good. You're gonna use half of a can per bottle of soybean sukiyaki mix. And then of course, you're gonna have to check out that thickness. See how it's like not too thin, but not too thick. Yes, it's like the perfect consistency. Well, almost perfect consistency. But we're gonna add some sugar to that because yes, we all love a little bit of this diabetes. And then we are going to add some Coco Rico. So this is a coconut soda. And what the coconut soda is going to do is not only add a little bit of sweetness to it, so it kind of balances out the flavors, but it's gonna thin it out and make it more of a hot pot consistency rather than being thick, like a thick sauce or anything. So yeah, and then of course you're gonna have to taste it. Mm -mm, delicious use the whole go ahead and use the whole can i was trying to save a little bit for myself but you know <laughs> anyways we're going to add the secret asian ingredients called msg i don't know if you've all ever heard of it but yes by the way that was a joke uh -huh. well we're pretty much done and so i had the besties taste it because i'm not eating this by myself but it was really good and you could have added other things like optional things like onion you could have added the fat from the beef tips but yeah so now we're gonna show you a little bit of a demonstration so we got a burner out we all sitting around the place we got our veggies all of that all around our meat our noodles and i didn't put out the bamboo mat underneath because i was too lazy to grab it but i like to put my pot next to the burner just so that if we need to refill it we can right there and so you know put that on very high heat um, start to get it hot once it starts simmering like that um, you can go ahead and start adding your veggies so that you can give it time to cook you know um, so we're gonna have we got some bok choy baby bok choy we got some mushrooms enoki all sorts of whatever you want you know if you like if you like lettuce you could put lettuce up in the bitch if you like ooh, I didn't mean to say that but anyways <laughs> we added some squid we have some crab we got, um, I believe we're gonna about to put some shrimp in there, right? Right? Right there, there's the shrimp. <laughs> and so anyways, um, to set up your bowl, you're pretty much going to put some noodles in your bowl and then once it gets really hot, so you see how it's starting to steam and it's about to, it's going to boil soon. Um, I don't want it to boil because I don't want the liquid to evaporate. So we want it very hot and that's when we add our beef in because the beef cooks really fast. And so then you can take your bowl with your noodles in it and you're gonna ladle all of it in, all your ingredients. And of course, everybody else will do the same and voila. Mm, mm, mm. that's right that means very delicious in Cambodian and look at that got the bestie showing off 
um, her bowl, and oh, it just looks very beautiful, very good. And that's pretty much the gist of it. And you can add whatever you like. You can um, grab and go, as you can see people people using their chopsticks to grab other people using the ladles for that young soup you can add more liquid later on and you eat however you want but yeah thanks for watching